in this special World of Sport, Roller Derby. Yes, our roller cycling tonight, and we're going to introduce two of the great champions uh, uh, during our uh, 25 years of World of Sport. They're 55 or so now, give or take a few months. But uh, on the red rollers, he needs really no introduction to cycling fans. The mighty Keith Reynolds, winner of 18 Australian track titles, 18 handicaps in one season, <laughs> including six from behind the scratch marker, won the first Melbourne six-day bike race with uh, his opponent here tonight, the mighty Sid Patterson on the yellow rollers, one of the world's all-time greats, four world titles, two Austral wheel races from scratch, hundreds of other events, 15 six-day bike races in Australia, plus the Paris Six with uh, Russell Mockridge, the late Russell Mockridge, and the great Roger Arnold. Two magnificent personalities and fellows that have done uh, wonders for the cycling game, so we're going to ask them just to turn those wheels around as we remember their performances of the past as they match uh, wits and speed over four laps. Bill Long, who's uh, handicapped both of them for so many years uh, in professional cycling in control of proceedings. Sid Patterson on the uh, yellow roller and uh, Keith Reynolds on the red roller. There's the mighty Sid. Four world titles, better known perhaps as a uh, pursuit rider and a track man and a uh, pursuit rider in his world titles, world amateur sprint champion, world pursuit, um, professional pursuit champion, a magnificent and mighty six day rider. Keith Reynolds, a brilliant handicap rider. A little bit of cat and mouse going on here. As, as they come up with three laps to go. Sid, Sid Patterson, of, uh, Keith Reynolds, Sid Patterson of course, raced in six day events all over Europe. Won a Berlin six day bike race. Intense competitor, Keith Reynolds, a brilliant handicap rider, a, a, a form of racing that's unique uh, to uh, riders uh, in Australia. And of course, in the old days of the Essendon board track, could they liven up a, uh, a five mile ace of scratch race, which is always the final event on the program. Of course, the mighty Billy Guyatt was also another uh, great uh, rider during those times. I don't know what they're going to get up to here, but they're obviously not taking any chances with each other. It's like a, this is like a, a derby. One of those North Essendon board track World Derbies. <laughs> Coming up to the bell lap now, and uh, Keith Reynolds in front by a little margin. One to go. They look at each other. There they go, the last 220 now. And they're still pretty close together with Reynolds just a shade in front. 110 to go and Pato's going at him now. And Reynolds has got to the line. <laughs> well, how about how that, about line? It, Louis? Ladies and gentlemen, big hand. I'll tell you what, that's the this time we timed that with a sundial <laughs> <laughs> and it took three hours and 20 minutes a fantastic effort fellas how'd you pull up keith <laughs> uh worse for wear ron <laughs> how about you city yeah good <laughs> Sid, could i ask you a question how long did it take to get into your gear <laughs> i thought you were going to say in the condition hey tell me that uh, well it took you longer to get into your gear to shave your legs is that right, <laughs> That's right yeah. i rang him up he said he's shaved so i had to do the same Sid, uh, <laughs> I shaved two. <laughs> you're quite Sid, okay, quite seriously, you? uh, our Olympic cyclists are uh, on the way to Los Angeles now. Uh, you're, you're a man who knows the international scene so well in amateur and professional ranks. And of course the cycling fraternity have given Australia such a great name on the international sports scene. Uh, I know you wish them well. What do you think of their chances? Well, I, th I honestly think it's the best, uh, they're the strongest team of cyclists we've ever had in uh, 20 years. Uh, there's uh, there's no, no cyclist now can do two jobs because they're all specialists. They've got uh, Rainsford's got a big chance. Clark, uh, Woods, four-man team pursuit. They could come home with four gold. 
Great. Great to have you with us, Sid. One of our uh, real favourites at World of Sport. And you too, Keith. Great to have you with us, Sid. Sid and uh, Keith. Keith. The bottle of champagne from Thomas Hardy. And I tell you, you had a breath still, Sid. Yeah. <laughs> and you watched tonight because the breathalyzer mob are out there too, eh? <laughs> Don't drink it now, Sid. <laughs> He's tempted. <laughs>